everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys you can see the error internet explorer cannot be displayed the web page if you are facing the similar issue this video is for you i will show you step by step how to troubleshoot this issue guys so first of all it's better to delete all the history if you are getting this issue on a regular pc if you have just set up the pc so you can follow the step as well so safety you need to go to the safety and go go to this op delete browsing history you can also press control control and h key also together now once you open that you need to tick all the boxes here and accept the password and delete all the boxes just click on delete okay it's going to delete now and check if that fix the issue or not so it doesn't fix the issue my case guys so i have to need to go to this page again tools then click on add manage add-ons and check if any extensions is enable if you have enable any extensions this is a default one you just need to remove them if this also doesn't fix the issue let's move on to the next method guys we need to open the control panel from here open the control panel and go to the large icons here and we need to go to the internet options okay so let me find out the internet options here here is the internet options click on that and once you click on that guys you need to look for this option which says delete all this will do the same setting but from the system as well now go to the advanced option and click on restore advanced setting and also apply this and once you apply that just click on reset option delete the personal setting click on yes now close this we are good to go and after that try to open the web browser and it should fix the issue guys and go to google.com like this and see if that is working for you or not if that is still not working for you let me show you guys you can see the my issue has been fixed okay it's going to another piece and see that is working now if i open the google chrome you can see it is opening up if you have still issue guys let me go to the registry editor we need to s add some settings here we need to go to this option okay open the registry editor type a registry or you can press windows plus r button type for res edit this one okay hit okay hit yes now you need to go to this path guys simply hk current user software microsoft so hk current user then we need to go to the software then you need to double click on microsoft then you need to double click on the internet explorer this one double click and once you double click you need to look for the main folder this one and once you open the main folder guy you need to look for enable pre bing value okay so inside here we need to look for e series okay press e on your keyboard Uh, inside here you can see guys i don't have this value enable pre bink value so if doesn't have you need to edit that just copy this you will get into a description box and we need to right click on the blank area new d word 32 bit and simply paste the value here okay once you have pasted the value enable
see option guys enable pre binding so you need to change its value to zero okay if it is one so you need to change its value to zero and hit ok once you have applied this setting you have to restart the system and after that i'm pretty sure your issue will be fixed so i hope guys your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed and hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching